Well, welcome to the overlap. And we've got a very, very, very special announcement to make. Now, we really wanted to sign one of the greatest Manchester United strikers of all time to the overlap. But unfortunately, Andy Cole and Dwight York wouldn't take our course. <laughs> so we ended up with this spud head instead. Ooh. But look, right, Wayne, in all seriousness, what's made you decide to come be a part of the overlap team? And has got anything to do with the fact that you've absolutely botched your other 45 jobs previously? <laughs> yeah, then, look, um, obviously when... When Gary um, rang me on the, on the on the on the microwave and said, "Look, Wayne, I'd like you to come and sign for the the lap over," I was um, obviously I was very excited. Um, he offered me two million pounds, but I said, "Gary, look, it's it's not about the money, so I'd like you to half that to seven million instead." So, but look, I think it's time you know to take time away from uh, making millions, relegating massive championship clubs, and. And make millions, you know, saying aim um, four thousand times in between sentences for no apparent reason. So, yeah, um. Well, look, I'm sure there's been other job offers waiting at your bad. I mean, why, why do you want to come and be a part of our team? Why? Yeah, look, um, I've tried many other jobs. I've tried relegating massive championship clubs, as I mentioned. Uh, I tried suing Jamie Vardy's bed for a couple of months. Didn't really enjoy that and got beat as well. Um, I tried playing. You know, on FIFA with ginger YouTubers who live in the mum and dad's basement, and I even started going to America, but I just couldn't um, speak the language. So, um. I know clearly you're still struggling with the English language, aren't you? <laughs> no, but but listen, right, Pundit is a very serious business. You've got to know what you're talking about. You can't just sit there nodding your head saying "aim" hey, 27 times and just agreeing with everyone. So we need to do a bit of practice, Wayne. Okay, so here we go, a little bit of practice, and I'll get ready for the debate. Okay. I think Manchester United are not a joke. I think Edison Ang should be executed. The old squads are a disgrace. Burns out old travel tomorrow. That club should be put into administration and cease to exist. Yeah, um, yeah, definitely. I agree. Absolutely. Um, what have I just said to you? Don't just sit there agreeing and saying him. And you've just done exactly that. No, um, but to be really honest with you, I don't think anyone in the world would disagree with what you've just said. Um, all those things need to happen to Man United, they're a disease, so, um, yeah. Oh, no, actually, probably that wasn't a good example that way. You know what, you're a natural already, but listen, the second part of it is, you've got to be professional, listen, you can't be getting caught in those hotel rooms with strange women and coming out of, you know, very mature ladies, massive parents at four in the morning. None of us do that, yeah, and you can't do that. Can you be professional, Wayne? Yeah, look, I think it's... Probably time now for me to be professional. I'm 56, so it's time to grow up, and that's why I've decided I think it's time now that I've come to the lap over that I remove the helmet. Oh, no, well, no, wait, we can't get rid of Gary Neville. We can't get rid of Gary Neville. It's his show, he invented it. Well, listen, listen, trust me, we've tried loads of times. We, we can't get rid of that helmet, Gary Neville. No, sorry, I'm talking about my helmet. Um, I think that. I think that it needs to go. Um, so, yeah, I just. Oh, I'm yeah, that, that's hand. what I thought you meant, Gary. Yeah, yeah, that, that's what I thought you meant to be fair, but uh, no, no, listen, I totally understand that. And if you just take that helmet off, that means we can all have a good laugh at that dodgy air transplant. <laughs> well, you you know, look at yourself. I mean, at least I don't get drunk on that channel. How do you spell it? C B S. Uh, slurring me words. That, that was embarrassing. Um, oh, like right, that is it! Like, that is it, right? It's okay. Like, well, listen, let me tell you something now, Wayne. I got that 25 pints of the strongest line of go and stellar ass while or something like that. And I still make more sense than you. Ha 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 Well, look, I'm, 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 um, I'm just going to say, look, now that I've come to the lap over, I'm going to make sure the lap over doubles its prescribers from uh, 1,000, 1 million, right up there to 500,000. I guarantee you that I'll make that happen. Um, well, I think I can speak on behalf of everyone at the overlap and all the fans that watch that I absolutely guarantee that you are going to do to the overlap what you did to Derby County in Birmingham City. You're going to take the fans away. Ha <laughs> ha Oh, listen now. Welcome to the overlap. We're looking forward to having a good laugh at you. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah, um, Yeah, just, I agree with that. Yeah.